Good morning. So we are starting this video at Horizon TV. I was here today for um, a TV interview with Mariam on her show. I don't know if you can, if you, yes, that TV show. Swab, 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 Swab morning show. Um, so day one of the period, I already have my cup in and we're going to take this to the next level and show you how the rest of the day is going to go. So guys, I am here with Dr. Um, Gatembura, who is a gynecologist, and I just want him to say something that he said during the interview that was very important about virginity and the cup or the tampons. Could you just take us through that one more time for those who missed it? Thank you. I'll just take a minute by saying that the female reproductive system at the entrance, we have a hymen. We have a hymen, and uh, this hymen guards the entrance. And under normal circumstances, the hymen is not completely sealed. It has a hole that allows the menstrual flow to come out. Mm -hmm. That allows the menstrual flow to come out. So as you are using a tampon at a cup, you don't break your hymen because it already has a passage okay. for you. So all you require to do is pass the cup through that hole that is created there or a tampon through that hole. So by using a cup or a tampon, you are not interfering with a ladies or a female's virginity or hymen. Okay. Yes. And and what of people who say that when you ride a bike or you climb a tree you lose your virginity? The the hymen the hymen is a semi membranous tissue, very transparent and very thin. So often at a normal circumstances, especially in the very active ladies, uh, like they are doing sports, they are riding, they are climbing trees and so forth, even learning, they break their virginity. So yeah. more often you break your virginity when you are uh, active. active. But only a few times that it's broken during during sex. So the fact that you have a, a broken hymen does not necessarily mean yeah, that okay. you are not a virgin. Okay. Yes. So virginity is only when you've had penetrative sex with a man. Yes. That is when you've broken your virginity. That's when you've broken your virginity. Thank you. Now you've heard it from the doctor himself. You know, I'm a shower beer, so get yourself your, your cups as soon as possible. <laughs> and now we are at Adara. I have just done my armpits. This is my fourth session at Adara Cosmetics with, um, with Clarice. Uh, do you want to say something about uh, laser? I'm so happy to have Eddie as my client. She's been a journey, but it's doing, it's doing well. Thank yeah. you so much for coming in. Yeah, and I, I love the progress of your laser hair removal. Yeah, it's going really great. So it's been four months of me uh, getting my hair removed uh, by laser so that basically in future hair will not be growing in my armpits. That's that's the main target, right? In right, the end. yeah, right. Um, it's my fourth session. And if you want me to do like an in-depth uh, look at if it's working or not, and you can also see my armpits and the whole process and how it's done. You can see your hands, like gloves and everything. Sure. Everything very professional here. Let me know in the comment section below if that is what you want and I will make a video on it as well. You are all welcome at Adara anytime with me, Clarice, at Along Gong Road in Greenhouse Mall. Greenhouse Thank Mall, you. yes. Yeah, come through. So, I am back home uh, from the last time you saw me after I came from Adara. Guys, I've been looking for one thing and one thing only. So, actually, let me show you. Let me show you what I've been looking for. Let me show you. See? See this? This fruit basket? I've been running around town looking for this exact same one. The only problem is this thing is only at, um, it's only at House of Leather. And only the House of Leather that's in, um, the one in town, you know, the, the one at Nakumat Lifestyle, the one that used to be Nakumat Lifestyle. That's the only place that I have found this basket. So, yeah, a little background. Uh... <laughs> The first, the first time I saw this basket, I was like, oh, it looks really nice, but it was eight thousands, eight thousands Kenya shillings. And I was like, no way. Like the only time I'm going to spend anything above like 4K, it better be like an electrical appliance, you know, like a fridge or a kettle or a microwave or something. Eight thousands, 
no way eight thousands that are paying that amount of money so uh later on the price went down to seven five and then right now it's a six eight i'm telling you i'm feeling pain even saying six thousand eight hundred i spent six thousand eight hundred shillings on this thing um but it's worth it i like it guys like look look doesn't it look nice with my um with my fruits so this is basically this is basically where I put my uh, my fruits and vegetables and onions and all of that. I just I just and okay. By the way, House of Leather have they have a different one for like six thousand. But the thing is, that's a straight one. And if you're having things like big things like pineapples and stuff like that, it will not really fit. So when you get one that's slanting, it gives you more um, more room or more space for all of that. But anyways. <laughs> How else will you not become an adult? These days you're spending money on such things instead of shoes and handbags. This is what you invest in. Um, anyways, right now I'm home, I'm hungry, my kitchen is such a mess but I will not touch it because I need to have something to eat, shower, take out the cup, take out the cup first, actually I'll take you to the bathroom as I take out the cup, shower and then by 6 we're supposed to go for the movie premiere. I think. Did I? No, I haven't talked about it, but it's a movie premiere. It's called um, it's called Dream Child. We shot it. We shot it a few. We shot it a few years ago. Actually, when did we shoot that? It's taken so long to come out. I even forgot when we shot it. I think it was last year when we shot it. Um, but yes, so it's. They said that it's starting at six, but trust me, I've been bitten once too many times to know that when an event is starting at six, it means that it starts at seven or eight. So my plan is to freshen up, do everything as quick as quickly as I can, then get my Uber at about 5.30. Yeah, 5.30 would be a good time because just traffic all the way, getting to ST from where I live is just going to be hell. But yes, oh, and something else I forgot to say. So as much as it was 6,800, I still got a voucher for, um, for, for 680 bob. So basically what's happening at um, House of Leather, I don't know if this has been an ongoing thing or I don't know, but I got a voucher for 680. So... <laughs> It's not that bad. I mean, I'm not gonna get my cash back, but um, I still have time to go back there and spend 680, 680 shillings. And then I also got, you get like a free gift. So I chose this one for myself, to my love. This is like a message. Um, I'm gonna put it next to my other fridge magnet. So this is my message to me. I am my own love. And then I got this plastic, plastic i'm hoping i don't know if it's airtight it doesn't look very airtight to me but also got this as a free gift when it came to um to buying that but anyways i no regrets i'm telling you for the first time when i saw this thing i was like this food basket i need it in my life i need it at eight thousand i was not gonna spend it but at six eight so it is time to take out this cup and I'm trying to angle this camera as carefully as I can because I'm naked, I'm just about to take a shower. Um, so let's take it out. Today's day one, oh, there's almost nothing. This is it. Well, it hasn't been 12 hours yet because I usually take out the cup um, around eight or something. Right now it's around four o'clock. So I've not had the cup for 12 hours, but still this is all I had. So I'm changing it now because I need to shower and then go to the premiere. I am not very sure if I'm gonna involve you in taking the cup out in the evening because when I wear it now, it means the next time I should take it out should be around 5, 6 in the morning. So when I wear it now, I don't think I'm going to take it out again. I'll just do it, um, go with it till tomorrow. So let me see you at Anga for the premiere of um, A Dream Child.
are starting today's video in the shower yesterday i have to be honest um i did not record anything just after the launch of dream child the following day today is saturday so on friday i did not record a thing i came home so late i was so tired but it was such a good day um the cup did its job um so right now it's it's almost 12 o'clock i've just been up and down doing a few things so i want to take out the cup and today i'm actually taking it out in the shower as opposed to in the toilet and uh, it's slimy but this is it this is all this is all we have this is all we have for today um it's going to be a long day actually let me just turn on the shower now it's going to be a long day today because um because you're going for a baby shower and then i'm gonna go to my friend's uh business place she's uh, her name is diana she's having um, a sale on her clothes so that's what we're gonna be doing anyway right now i need to shower very quickly so i am off just when i get to the gate so that i can catch my uber who's on the way in the meantime I just want to show you my driveway. Like, how pretty is this driveway? Huh? How nice is it? So, that's the main, the gate to my house is over there. And then the gate, now the main gate to the, the main gate to the outside road. So, it's a really, it's a really quiet, it's a really quiet kind of place. Like you see, it's just filled with trees and birds and and things like that. Anyways, the next time that I see you, I'm gonna be at Simbares Fashions for their sale and also to see my friend Diana and then the baby shower, which I'm kind of already late for if this is the time that I'm leaving my house and still waiting for the Uber. Hi! So we are here at Simbares Fashions. Like I told you, this is Diana. She's having a sale. She has amazing stuff, guys. Let yes. me, what's that, Diana? I will hold here so that they can see. They can see this dress. Yes. This is my wife material. Wife material, yeah. Nakwambia. She yeah. looks amazing. Amazing. Yeah, this is a nice outfit. And then show them all these other ones that they have. Yes. They have everything plus accessories as well. But yes. So we have blazers, we have tops, we also have shirts for men. Yeah. We have some shorts for women, we have skirts. Nice. All of them just no, Simbares like fine like cut yeah. luxury. Yeah. Entrepreneurs, I'm telling you. Yes. Let me also show them what you are wearing. Look at what she's wearing. So I'm wearing a long cape. Uh -huh. and it's on sale. How much is the long cape with me? I think it's like good money. Three five. Three five. Yeah, this is like three thousand five hundred. The cape or the outfit? The cape, the cape. Ah, okay. The pants are different. Ah, look at that. It, it yes. it's it's attached to this one. Yes, it is. So nice. Is a, the long cape is three five. The short capes are how much? Two five. I love it. This is a shorter version of it. And it's all Ankara fabric, guys. Kariboni. In fact, I want to try out this one next. Yes. Let, let me let me come and try it. Try it on. Yes, and I feel like it goes well with my skin tone. Yeah. Yes, but you have amazing skin as well. Look at that. Fast lady. Fast lady. This is fast lady material. Yes, it I is. I just need the right shoes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know? And a clutch bag. Yeah. Like... It's good to see you. I also like that it's not tight. Like, it's not trashy. Mm -hmm. You know, like, it's revealing, but not less. Yeah. yeah. I love it. And, and that's just 3500 How much is the dress? 2500 That's 25 They're all on sale. Now I've already picked three. Thank you. You're welcome. Ah. <laughs> I'm back home it is about eight o'clock i've had such a lovely day honestly i overspent at diana's place um at simbares fashions by the way i'm gonna leave her link to her instagram she has amazing amazing stuff and most things are on 50 percent off so i went ham i got 
like seven outfits, seven different outfits. Like it's it's crazy. It's ridiculous. I know that was not the plan. The plan was to spend about 5k. Just multiply that by about four. Yeah. That's <laughs> that's about how much I spent today. Yeah, it was over shopping, but it was definitely worth it. Um, I got a lot of like office official stuff, um, which and I love her style because it, she incorporates like a bit of African and Tara, but very modern. She's, she is a very stylish lady. Um, but then after that, I went for the baby shower slash baby reveal. It was a girl. I was wrong. I thought it was gonna be a boy. It was a girl, but it was all fun. I really I loved it. It. So today is day number three. Yeah, today is day number three of my period, which I'm expecting to be the last day. Oh, there you go. There you go. This is all I have. I've stayed with this cup the whole day, and this is all we've collected. Um, technically, this should be the last day, but I am not very sure. So tomorrow, I'm still gonna wear the cup just you know because we're gonna we're, we're gonna be having like drops and those last days of having a period good morning beautiful humans so i have literally just woken up i want to take out the cup shower very quick because i am running a bit late for the photo shoot with my um with my knees so i just wanted to show you how much oh it's actually quite a lot so this is what i collected through the night yeah that's what I collected through the night um, right now I just want to shower really quick and then I will see you in a few minutes I am back home. I am about to take out the cup. I had such a beautiful day with my brand new niece. She is 11 days old, by the way. Um, the photographer that we are working with, um, her name is Lolly Photographer. I am going to leave her link for her Instagram 
on um, on the description box. So I was considering two photographers for this shoot for my niece. There was one that I thought she was good, but she hadn't really handled a lot of um, like young babies, like a few day old babies. So I considered, I decided to go with Lolly because she seemed to have a bit more experience when it comes to very, very tiny babies. She was slightly more expensive than the, than the first one, but at the end of the day, I never compromise quality um, because of price. Like if the if the quality is good, then I will pay whatever price that um, that's demanded. But anyway, that's that. And then we went for lunch, and then they came to my house because they've also never been to my new place. So they came to, to know the house, and then we just chilled and talked. And right about now, it is time to take out the cup. This is the final day of my period. Oh, it's also still quite a lot, actually. Um, yeah, this is it. Ah, dripping. So this is it. Uh, that's all we've um, collected for the 12 hours that we've been having this period. So this is the final day of the period. And uh, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, it's dripping. I need to stop this now. I realized I left you guys hanging. I didn't do like a sign out. I didn't sign out of the video. So I am about to go in for my workout at Dojo. I'm working out at Dojo Wellness Club. Um, and I'd like to say please subscribe to my channel. If you have not already, please like the video and let me know in the comments below what else um, you want. You want from my channel in future. And I will see you next week. Bye. Clarice. Okay, I have to Okay, it's you talking fast. Yeah.